show you how to create a course in the Envis site. Of course, you go to envis.esucc.org and you log in. Then you click up here to Courses. And two things. I like to check and see if the course was already in the system from last year. So I would go to the previous year and let's say I am trying to see if there is a course for Newman Grove. There are. And maybe I want companion animals for the 23-24 school year. So I would click on companion animals and then duplicate it, which there's another video about duplicating. So let's say it wasn't in here. I want to completely add a new class because I didn't find it in here. So under management, I go to course management and then I add a new course. First of all, I would put the name of the course in and we're going to call this Spanish, probably one. Um, who is the local school? Um, we will put ESU8, whatever the local school is, I can give a description. If I don't have anything, I'll just put Spanish one again. Subjects, it's a foreign language. Usually, if I don't know, I just put 9th through 12th grade. More information than is absolutely needed, any prerequisite or comments, and then I create the new course. Then from there, I have to create the section. So I would put the instructor in, type of credit it is, if it's just high school or if it's dual credit, and then delivery model, synchronous or asynchronous online. Synchronous is if you are meeting face-to-face, -face, even over distance learning or Zoom, that's synchronous. So if it's only one semester, then my start date if it's the fall it would be in August and my end date would be in December. If it's just spring, start date January, end date May. If it's a full year course, start date August, end date May. Times and then um, this obviously isn't starred so you can put in as much information as possible till a student count is there. You do not have to put in the codec anymore and then I create the section. Once I've created the section, oh, I didn't put the times in. Then I could go back and add other courses, other people to the courses. Let me show you on one of those. Let me go here. So I could come down here and add another enrollment add the school, how many students, and then save that request. And that is how you add a course to Envis.